Okay, guys, so I've stayed silent way too long. This is Danny Alvarez with cellphonias.com, bringing the latest news and views that you can use. A lot of people are talking about the Note 7 and how it's been exploding and how it's no longer, uh, and have been giving options to replace the Galaxy Note 7. And they're giving recommendations like the LG V20 and, you know, the next, uh, the new uh, Google Pixel and uh, et cetera. I think the most obvious replacement for the Galaxy Note 7 is the very stable one I'm recording with right now, Galaxy Note 5. Get with the Galaxy Note 5, Samsung will get its act together. Uh, many believe that the Note brand is tarnished to where they can't return with the Note. I'm not convinced that that's the case. I'm still convinced that they might come out with a new and improved Galaxy Note 8, and if they did, change the name of the brand just to say that a new completely redesigned totally safe and likely just a little less expensive with a lot of features kind of like the way they did the s3 when it came out it wasn't the most expensive phone yet it was the the phone with the most features any phone had ever seen when it came out um it was the galaxy s3 now they didn't name it differently i believe that Samsung is probably going to just rename the Note brand, something like the Samsung Galaxy Script Pro, or something like that. At least that's what I would buy. That's the, the brand I would associate again. With those of you that like the Galaxy Note 5, the Galaxy Note 4, 3, 2, and uh, the original Note, uh, through AT&T in that case, uh, we'll absolutely love the new and improved features, and they better make this phone the longest lasting battery the, the ultimate phone. I mean, the Note 7 was already uh, what I would call the ultimate phone, except it still competed hand to hand or neck to neck with uh, uh, the iPhone 7. It did not have one piece of spec that totally and completely blew iPhone out of the water. And I think that battery is the way to go. They're already dabbling with graphene. They're already dabbling with new and improved products. They can always say, okay guys, we learned our lesson. We're no longer using this type of battery. Now we're making our batteries in this form. And hey, as an added benefit, here is the amount of time that you're gonna get with this device. Now look at Google Pixel phones and how long they're promising in terms of uh, you know, phone on-screen time, etc. You know, video watching and whatnot. It, it, they're pretty much blowing everybody out of the out of the uh, uh, out of competition uh, regarding the number of hours that you can be on the phone, and that's a big selling point. Yet Google still doesn't have that brand recognition for phones uh, on the mainstream for n normal people that would warrant or that would um, definitely let me or, or uh, allow me to think or lead me to think that they're definitely going to be the replacement for the Galaxy Note 7. I don't think they are. Um, as beautiful as the camera is and as wonderful as the features are, I believe that Samsung has a very strong shot due to the reputation they've built to bring back a phone with uh, features of the Note plus the most improved battery ever and just rebrand it. And again, I'm blessing the name Samsung Galaxy Script Pro. I'm thinking that's probably a really good one. Samsung, listen to me. I think that would be a really good uh, opportunity for you. Anyways, let me know what you think in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe to this video. Share it with your friends and join the conversation. For cellphonias.com and for the cellphonias YouTube, ch YouTube channel, I did get that out right. For cellphonias.com and for the cellphonias YouTube channel, this is Danny Alvarez. Check it out.